Yeah, it's here. Whether we like to think about it or not, it's here. And uh, I'm excited about it. I'm excited about our club. Uh, the quality of the individuals, the character of our young men is something that excites me. It's going to be a fun year coaching them. Uh, we've got a chance to be a very good team if, uh, we, uh, if I don't screw them up and uh, things like that. Playing Temple, Fran Dunphy is a coach, is a great friend. Uh, uh, last year, early in the season, they beat Kansas by 25, and it was, oh my goodness, we're scheduled to play those guys next year, and they got several of those guys back. But uh, it'll be a great experience for our guys. Uh, we're going to try to eat with the uh, midshipmen. I don't think they call them cadets. I think they call naval guys midshipmen. We're going to eat with them, try to have some good experiences they'll remember for the rest of their lives. The experience we had on the aircraft carrier with uh, Tom Izzo's Michigan Skate Squad is about as good as I've ever had. Uh, we're in a situation where last year, if I'm not mistaken, ESPN's top three rated games in their college basketball season was North Carolina Duke, Duke North Carolina, and North Carolina Notre Dame in the finals of the ACC tournament. So we're going to be seen by a lot of people. A lot of, there's a lot of interest out there, and I think that when kids come to school here, they know they're going to play in great tournaments, they're going to play in special events, they're going to get special opportunities, and it's something that we really look forward to. Last year, our uh, uh, schedule was ranked number one in the country uh, by the Sagarin ratings, number two in the country by the tournament committee. I think this year's schedule is even tougher than last year's was, but I do think it gets you ready uh, for conference play because it gives you a true picture of what your club is like. Well, it's going to be a hard game for me because uh, Mark Turgeon was my assistant for four years and just a great individual a guy I really love and a big-time basketball coach. I was thrilled for him, the success they had last year, the first year in the Big Ten. I hated to see them leave the ACC because I'm one of those old-school guys, uh, but it was a great year for Mark. He's helped himself in the recruiting. This club this year is going to be even better. Uh, I do believe that both teams will be ranked probably in the top ten of the country in the preseason. Uh, that part is going to be a big time thing. The ACC Big Ten angle, it'll be, a, it'll be one of the biggest, if not the biggest, single matchup in the preseason. I do want to test our team uh, before we get into conference play. I want to test them on true road games. Uh, the Northern Iowa game, of course, is to take uh, Marcus Page back home. <laughs> it is hard to believe that Marcus is a senior. We feel very blessed to have had that young man uh, for three years. He's been a joy every single day, and it is unbelievable that he is a senior this year, and I'm hoping he has a great, great year because he's been an absolutely fantastic image for the University of North Carolina and for student athletes across the country. Uh, the Texas game, it's not that close to Houston, but it, we're getting Justin Jackson close to his, at least in his home state kind of thing. It's a marathon, it's a grueling marathon once you get into that uh, conference schedule and who we're playing in our league is just the who's who of basketball. It's the strongest conference in the country and I think it's going to be, have a three or four or five year period here that'll show that it's the strongest league and maybe the strongest league we've ever had in the country for college basketball. Two games in three days is very difficult, there's no question, especially ACC games you know, because of the caliber of the opponents. I do believe it's what you will face if you're lucky enough to get in the NCAA term at the end of the year, that you're gonna play two games in three days against that same quality of opponent. So I think it's good for us. Uh, the Monday night games have been great for ESPN's package. I think it's uh, uh, the uh, likelihood of seeing big time games on Monday night out of the ACC is very strong every Monday night, and we're proud to be involved with three of them. This time of the year, you really get excited uh, the players get excited because they're ready for the season to start and get rid of the practices, you know, six days a week. But uh, this is an exciting time for a college basketball coach.